A new study published in the journal Proceedings of the National Academy of Sciences argues that of all the tools we have to decrease the spread of the coronavirus, wearing a face mask might be the most important. Researchers analyzed the data on different mitigation measures put into place in three major centers of the outbreak, Wuhan, China, Italy, and New York City. They found the biggest drop in the number of cases after masks were made mandatory. They also found that the major means of transmission was through respiratory aerosols. That information, combined with the data on different mitigation measures, led them to conclude that wearing face masks will be the largest determinant of whether this coronavirus spreads or slows. Now, there are different experts who disagree that masks make much of a difference. Dr. Amesh Adalja of the Infectious Disease Society of America told ABC News he has yet to see much direct evidence to support making masks mandatory, especially masks that are homemade. He points to New Zealand, which largely got its infection under control without the widespread use of masks. The debate over whether masks should be mandatory will probably rage for months. But if you're going somewhere in public where you can't maintain your physical distance from other people, wearing a mask can decrease your chance of catching and spreading this coronavirus at least a little bit. I'm Dr. David Geyer.